Give me that shirt, boy. <clears throat> <I said I'm laughs> anyway. <laughs> Yeah, this good old hand of mothers to just yeah. call him on this yeah. shit, man. Mm. <laughs> I, I can't speaking. imagine Kim Kardashian like I, I can't imagine what their arguments were, but I know they I, I don't think that she would have like been somebody who could steamroll him if he was wrong. Like I just feel like he's the type of person. He, he he was with her for a reason, and now she's out of that relationship. Thank God, but mm-hmm. mm-hmm. they have all what nine, almost ten years. They were married and dating. It's just wow. a decade of just nonstop attention and yes, man. That's, mm. boy, I know, I know there. some somebody else who is uh, calling a uh, people to task is Herschel Walker's son. That was another thing that was on Twitter. So so who was Herschel Walker? Okay. Herschel Walker is, uh, uh, I don't know who he used to play football for, but anyway, he's Georgia. Georgia is a retired football player who's currently running for senator Mm. in in, uh, Georgia. Mm. He's running against, or the Republicans tagged him to run against another African-American man, um, uh, 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 Warnock, Warnock's first name. Warnock is uh, uh, the current senator in Georgia. Mm. Warnock and I forgot the other senators were the two that turned uh, when Georgia turned blue. They went to the Senate, and then they had more uh, Democratic. Raphael Warnock. That's that's um, Warnock's name. So anyway, Herschel, at true to current Republican form, uh, you know, with the most despicable, d- despisable. Uh, just just guttural people that they can find. Herschel Walker is that. They are running him <laughs> because he is a they're they're pitting a black man against another black man, so that you can't you know. So it, it, that's that's part of the the charm. That's part of the magic here. Herschel is has been caught in lies. He said he was a police officer. He was, and he said he uh, had you know <laughs> How do you a, say a police officer. And and so currently, so what has just surfaced is he's, uh, you know, running on this pro-life platform and it just mm. came out that he paid for his girlfriend's abortion some years mm. ago. And they actually have receipts. Look, the receipt from the clinic, the check, the $700 Rest check, they got a copy of it. The card he sent, the card, the card. he sent her after the abortion. Rest and, uh, this lady the said, Here's the thing about women. Men may not do this. We save stuff. Stop sending stuff. <laughs> if you don't want it to come back, stop sending stuff. Is so that why well, girlfriends are always asking for stuff? It could be. If you give it, it's going to be saved <laughs> for whatever stuff. period of time. But you um, more incriminating a trial she, against you, yeah. <laughs> but she still has the yeah. card. She still has the card. Anyhow, so his son. <laughs> she kept like, that for a different reason. <laughs> you know, to keep a, a, a sorry for your abortion card for what, 20 because something her years. Because it's Herschel better. gave it to her. That's why she kept it. Because it's signed by her. Yeah, signed by her. Well, his son is a um, uh, right wing uh, uh, TikToker. So he's got all of these, you know, black Ooh. men. Or, or the black family, uh, the black men absent, and, and all these absent fathers, and all of this stuff, just denigrating the black community for whatever reason. So he's consistently on there. So he's just been going, taking his fa- father to task on on all of this stuff. He's like, whatever the past, stop the lies. You know, you stand there, you say these things didn't happen, and they did. So he went on this rant. I mean, I've never seen a tick. Talk rant on like the national news or MSNBC, <laughs> but they're showing clips of this guy. You know, he's just going on and on about his father. I railed against <clears throat> absentee fathers because I experienced that. Mm. He's got four kids. Yeah, he's got four kids, and he did not. You did not raise any of them. You know, you were not in the house with any of them. He don't um, look like he raised a damn kid. He just out there. But if you heard him talk, you know that he probably has not very much to offer, but just his presence. Well, so uh, and I'll give let me give them more context to this guy because yeah, yeah, Herschel Walker came up during my dad's time. Okay, he was 
for lack of better words, he was, I mean, he was a super stud athlete. <clears throat> he was known to only do calisthenics for most of his career, even in NFL college, Heisman winner. He does like a couple thousand push-ups, sit-ups, squats every day. Of course. But if you look at pictures of him and you look at, I mean, he's a very solid, jacked, strong guy. That's it. He's like, that's his thing. He only eats one meal a day, from what I understand. He did his first UFC fight or MMA fight when he turned like 50. <laughs> um, and um, that, he's just one of those guys that's just all I do is no football and, and, and aggression. So that kind of like he has going for him. He came out of Georgia. You know how that part of the country is. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> They like it, and he's one of those like Black Forest Gump type dudes. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> but he is ridiculous, man. Some of the stuff he says, I'm like, you can't be talking shit about the left side and have a fucking dude like this. He he had a comment on the bad air in China. Yes, and he tell said, him, John. Tell him. I can't quote it, but he literally said something about the reason why China has the reason why our air is getting bad is because. Air don't have no 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 law, no walls, so it, uh, good air went to yeah. China uh, and yeah. mixed up with the bad air and pushed the bad air over to us. Yeah, and and that's yeah. why we have the stuff <laughs> that we have today. It's, it's, our, it's our good, okay. our good yeah, air. Sounds like solid science. Yeah, who which 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 science? You said solid science. That, that sounds like solid science. Text yeah, book yeah exactly. science right there, baby. <laughs> oh my, textbook. If our good air <laughs> goes over there to China, or well, what they bad air, where can it go? It can only come back over here to us because our <laughs> good air is over there. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what? Some of these people, I, I've noticed the algorithm, man. Mm. I'm gonna call it like it is. There's a the algorithm rule, there has to be a rule where if you like to shit on black people. It immediately sends your your content to a whole nother level. <laughs> you could be talking about doves, and if you end it on, and that's why black people ain't shit. <laughs> your shit, your algorithm gonna get pushed up, and you are gonna get with the Candace Owens and all those people yeah. that are. Because I'm just seeing people like, who are these people with all these millions of views? All these starch Republicans following these individuals. Now I don't know if it's a money play. And it's some real spook sat by the door shit where they're like, I'm about to just shit on black people, just take all their money, and then I'm gonna just come out and be like, ha ha, I got y'all. But I honestly have seen a lot of these types of things, and Herschel Walker is one of the most, you know, prevalent. How did this dude online. even get selected for this position? Like, how did this, how did oh. him <laughs> going from whatever he was doing before into a political candidate happen? Yeah. So he's a good friend. He's a good friend of Donald Trump. Um, Back in the day, Donald mm -hmm. Trump created the XFL. Mm -hmm. Probably don't know much about it, but I was a football guy. It was a private NFL league when some people in the NFL wouldn't let other owners in. Donald Trump was one of the owners. Guess who he invested in heavily? Herschel Walker. Mm -hmm. So Herschel Walker mm -hmm. won't say a damn thing about Donald mm -hmm. Trump, mm -hmm. even if he starts... Um, even if he's the one that showed all the receipts for the abortions, he won't say nothing about yeah. them. So that voice for Herschel Walker, I mean, it's kind of like Kanye West, man. Yeah. They see a black dude who has some influence, who has some legacy um, in, in their eyes. Oh, he's done more for black people than Malcolm X. Look at him. He okay, is one of Heisman. What has Malcolm X brought them? You know, that's how they look at it. He'll get up there. <laughs> uh, no yeah. disrespect to my no. next, I'll fuck with him. But that's yeah. like but he doesn't have any eyes. In, so. He doesn't have any eyes. He's gonna carry their water. He's gonna, <laughs> carry their water. He's gonna do what they ask him to do because he doesn't know anything. He doesn't have any position. He's just uh, along for the ride in this, you know. And uh, one of the things his son said is like, we begged him. Every member of the family begged him not to run. Because you had all this dirt that's gonna come out. They begged him and he just he ignored it and just went on 
and whatever. But we're at a point in our our uh, political uh, 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 society or politics in our society is at a point that all of the everybody who's making comments on this stuff that's come out is like this isn't hurtful. This isn't anything that's gonna you know drown him or really take him out of the race because the people who are for him don't care yeah. about you know any of yeah. these inconsistencies or hypocrisies and, and see, or that's that's the and that's, that's the craziness because that's it makes it. me want to run for president as a Republican because once you get the nomination you can get up there and say whatever the fuck you want like mm -hmm. Eric Cartman level like I yes. if I was South Park I would have Eric Cartman <laughs> run as a Republican because they won't ever deny anything. It's always the party over everything. And they will never <laughs> shit on this person because if they do, then it's going to validate the liberals who are opening up the floodgates to the Republican. That is a comedian's fucking dream <laughs> is to just run as Republican, talk a lot of shit, get paid a whole lot of money and just disappear. And in the next four years, when the next election come out, come back again, hit them again until they see the tide change um, because they don't give a damn. Um, they they don't give a damn at all. I seen the, what's the dude, uh, the coin guy. Um, what's the two guys that we one guy that got in the, in the scandal and his brother was working for like the, the network. Oh, the network oh Cuomo, to, Cuomo. The Cuomo's. Like yeah. they don't give a fuck about each other. They they're hustling the system. I literally they'll go on like my brother got locked up for shit like that. I would never go on the media and slam him for no kind of money. <laughs> like they'll but they but they'll like they they play the games to try to get the who who mm -hmm. has the eyeballs and who has the the presumption of righteousness. But that that doesn't work. Like you can't be perfect and be a, a presidential candidate. Donald Trump has broke that. Obama yeah. has, that mode will never be filled. You would never yeah. have a perfect ass president that says everything perfect, looks good, walks cool, shoots basketball. We're going to start having some real ass human beings, man. That's that's what it is. So we need like... Um, some real ass human beings? Are you, you saying that Trump, <laughs> his type is a real ass human being? No, human I'm being. saying Trump oh, broke okay. it to a point oh, where... Okay. If you got like yeah. I was watching, I was watching the YouTube where the mobster they was like, "Who would you vote if you had if you could vote?" There was a fucking mobster. If you could vote. He was like, <laughs> "Well, I kind of like that Trump." The fucking mobster. He didn't kill all these people. Said out of his mouth, "If I could vote, I'd vote for Trump." Yeah. That says a lot. We we I, cut to a uh, we cut to a high school classroom. Mm -hmm. Hey uh, hey John, um, before you leave uh, to go to your next class, I just want to say something real quick. Uh, look, I know this. Maybe this wasn't on your radar, but the uh, the school election is coming up, and I really want you to run. I know you're failing my class. You get into fights like every weekend. I, 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 you're kind of a rough kid, but I like that about you. You're a yeah, whole man, ass. Can you human. back up a few. You, you oh, stand oh, in my of course, of course, space. Of course. I'm kind of upset right now. All of right. course, yeah, that's much better. I, I'm. I've been working as a school for seven years. And I'm sick of seeing these goody two shoes, lollipop kids win all the time. I want to mm -hmm. see some real kids who've seen some real stuff, have some real opinions. I've seen some yeah. real stuff. Oh, I know you have. I know you have. I can tell. I can tell in your writing. You know, this is English class. And from what I can actually read, from what you say, it, it is you, some disturbing stuff. And I can't always follow your train of thought. And I love that about it. It's, it's just, like a stream you seem of to consciousness. Just go off, yeah, yeah, <laughs> to another realm. That's how I be in my world, you know, because I see so much stuff, so much crazy <laughs> shit that it just changes the way my mind works, and I just let the motions go, and I'm not. I just take a back seat and let my mind just just take over like autopilot, bro. <sighs> That that must be it. I was reading your you know your latest essay, which was supposed to be about the uh, uh, global warming, and you wrote about something you called underground birds. Yep. Uh, which I w I'm still not quite sure what that is. It sounds like a bat to me, but you said it's not a bat. You said they're birds, but they are only underground. They never go above the light, and and they suck blood. They they drink blood. 
Still sounds like a bat. Still sounds like a vampire <laughs> bat to me. We cut to a science. We cut to a science class. Hey, Amici, before you uh, don't don't we let everybody else um, leave the classroom? I want you to stay behind for a second. Okay. Okay. All right. Good. Now we can talk. Look, um, you've been um, student council president for uh, the past year and a half with my backing as your mm -hmm. science teacher. You're a great student. You've got everything it takes. Everybody responds to you. They see your real leadership qualities. But I'm hearing that um, I'm hearing that um, Mr. Mr. Antoine, the English teacher, is backing a a, a, a candidate to run against you, and he's backing. Uh, yeah, um, when you say English teacher, it's kind of iffy if he actually teaches any English. I know, I know, I know. He's filling the space of an English teacher. You know, yeah, nobody yeah. they haven't the review of his credentials hasn't come back yet. So I mean we're <laughs> desperate. We have to we have right. to accept right. it. But um the problem is that it's John. You know John, right? Uh, Maybe, yeah, yeah, because he's suspended so much uh that he's not <laughs> in class enough, but everybody his reputation precedes him. Mm -hmm. Right? Uh I think yeah. Yeah, I, I'm a little confused as how he's allowed to even run for president when he's yeah. He's hugged okay. everyone in school. I, exactly. He's failed yeah. everything. I don't understand. Mm -hmm. But some kind of way, Mr. Antoine is backing him. So I just want you to know, I think you have it in the bag. You know, you're a great student. Okay. You've been president for so long that, you know, I think we just stay the course. We stick with a positive message. And, you know, we don't let any of his attacks or anything that he tries to right. throw at you, throw you off. Okay? Okay. Oh. Yeah, that sounds good. I, I think everyone else is doing a good job. Uh, you, you know, I, yeah, I'll, I'll just keep doing what I'm doing. You know, sounds so, great. So just say the course, be positive, be be, be happy. Great. And uh, yeah. Okay. No, I, I, I got to win, right? I have to win. You, you are going to win. Of course. There's no question. Hey, hey, John, uh, don't mean to sneak up at you, um, you at the yeah, water fountain here. Almost um, stabbed you, bro. I, I would have deserved it. I would have deserved it. But, uh, I don't know. Do you know? Uh, do you know Amici? You mean Amici. shithead? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I know that. Fool. That's great. That's great. Yeah. Um, you know, he's thinking that he has this in the bag. He's thinking that you he ain't got shit in the bag, but shit. When I get yeah. talk with him, and I'm talking colostomy bags, son. That's that's fantastic. That's fantastic. Yeah. Where I, yeah, you had already marked them. He ain't making it out of school today. Well, hold on, hold on. You do, you guys do have debates later today. Um, I don't so. have no debate. It's either they gonna say what John say, or we gonna do it the other way. The other way gets brutal. You know what I'm saying? I feel like that should be your slogan. I feel like that should be your slogan. That, it's that is a great John's way, or it's, it's the other way, and I'm being brutal. I mean, but, uh, I I've been seeing a lot of these posters up around. First off, I don't know how the school approved so many messages with the word shit in it to be put <laughs> on the walls here. You know, there's a lot of that. And then this John's yeah. way, you know, we're going to do it the John's way or no way. I, yeah, I, I don't get it. Like, um, he didn't show up for the debate, but everyone is on Twitter saying he won. I, I don't. Understand? I don't. I don't understand either. I, I was there. I asked all the questions. You know. Yes. He, he wasn't there at all. Listen again. I still think we've got it. There's no. I, I'm. A, I'm a little concerned. I mean, maybe that's just one person on Twitter or, or whatever, just saying something. And yeah. You shouldn't really yeah. take those numbers to heart. But um, mm -hmm. uh, stay the course. Uh, another disturbing thing I heard was you know possible threat of violence. But I'm going to have the school resource officer be aware of it and, uh, you know, make sure that you're okay. safe. OK, that's why the police is here in the school, just to okay. make sure you're safe. Hey, hey okay. John, uh, yeah. I got you uh, got to a meeting set up with the uh, the Russian literature class, uh, the, oh, yeah. the club, I mean. So uh, I know that they uh, they're not necessarily well liked by the school. But, uh -huh. but I think they can help you out here. They really want to talk to you. They like a lot about what you're doing. They like what I'm talking they, about. They like what you're talking about. 
okay. yeah, the, 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 what your the platform you're running on seems to agree a lot with what goes on in Russian literature. Okay. So I, I think they just they seek some commonalities there. Are they going to share with me what's in this literature? Because I don't read. Uh, I'm sure I'm sure they'll help you out any way they can. Okay. I just wanted to let you I'd know. I'd love to meet with them, feel they vibe out a little bit. I, I could tell in the first five minutes if it's going to be a lot of colostomy bags, I'm going to have to be <laughs> delivered. Bad to news. Them. Bad news, Amici. Bad news. I tried to set up a meeting with the school resource officer. Apparently, he's backing John. Okay. He says, John, what? yes. He's like, John has a great plan for all police officers in school. <laughs> and so he's 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 gonna follow, he's gonna follow that. Moreover, moreover, Amici, I'm so disturbed. I heard that John took all of the records from the school, every student's record. John has got a hold to all of the records. He has them at no. home. I don't even know how <laughs> I do that. <laughs> because now now we're like on equal yeah. level. If I you know, I put a notice hard work in school and now we're like equal. No, I, I, I can't do that. This is, I, I don't I don't understand what's going on. Your scholastic, scholastic excellence to take precedent over this. Uh, I'm going to have to get in touch with the principal. You hold it down here. I'm, I'm going to just go and talk with the principal. And I, I'll let you know what's, what's happening. We got Terry talking to the principal. Oh, yeah, there's, my hands are kind of tied. They're I, not tied, Principal Antoine. What what am I supposed to do? Send teachers to his house to get the records? Like he yes. he told me he was running for school the presidency and he needed to review the records. It was his right as a candidate. And yes. I before I could even figure out what he was talking about, he 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 was gone. So and you didn't you didn't try to t get the school resource officer to to, to stop him? School resource officer showed him where the records were. This, what, what, this I, like I said, is... my hands are tied, and I, I'm I'm getting sent a lot of letters in Russian, and I don't understand any of it. What, what, what is this for? Listen, you have got to show some real leadership here, or else we're going to lose control of the school. This is just a student election. John is running amok, and might I add, he's dangerous. Lots of talk oh. about colostomy bags. And 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 uh, and threats to my can't. To, I'm sorry to Amici, and and I I just won't stand for it. This is this is beyond what what what's happening. And if I have to go to the school board, if I have to go to the school board to get some relief and redress of these issues, I will do that. I I sound like a great idea. Actually, I should have thought of that. I'm myself. sorry, I can't wait, wait outside any longer. Pr Principal Antoine, I, I I have some strong complaints about John. This is strong complaints about John. Hold on, hold on. Why are you telling telling me? What am I going to do about it? Because you're the principal. You're supposed to do something about it. He, this... he, he, he's out there telling people, I'm, I'm letting in students from other schools uh, come in here and, and, and steal all our lunches. And he said, I'm, I'm letting the bad <laughs> That's that's the way you win, yes. bro. That's how you win. That's how you win the election. <clears throat> Turn everybody against everybody except for you. <laughs> Make everybody fight for you. And then it's just like, well, he's the only one not fighting. We're gonna vote for him. Ah. Uh, John started oh. bringing in other students from other schools <laughs> and dropping them off in classrooms. <laughs>